All right, guys, I got a booster box for you today. New set on Broken Bonds. Of course, you all might know we're trying to get that Brescia Ram and Charizard Hyper Rear card. Hopefully, we can pull one here tonight. Got a lot of packs to open for you. Yeah, we're trying to pull that guy right there. Wish me luck. Haven't really opened too many from the set yet, but from what it looks like, people aren't having very much luck with it yet. <clears throat> At least from what I've seen. So hopefully I'll have some luck. Better luck than most people, that's for sure. This one girl at a shop earlier had pretty good luck. She got Rush Ram, Hyper Rare, and regular GX version of the Tag Team Duo. Yeah, so far not doing too well. Of course, there's plenty of other cards in this set to pull as well that are worth it. Pull the Dene. It's a pretty good card as well. Some of the full art cards, such as Red's, uh, I can't remember the name of it. Red's Challenge. And then Green's Exploration. A couple other cards that are good. Say hi to our little buddy Froki there. So far, nothing good here at all. <clears throat> this might be the first booster box ever in existence that doesn't have any good cards in it. Just kidding. Maybe when you start doing the card trick, that's what it is. Wow. Wouldn't that be funny? Still open a booster box and not get a single ultra rare out of it. I wonder if that's ever happened. I know I've opened some packs. I've gotten multiple energies out of it. Alright, we got a Mew. That's not bad. Mew's good. I was psychic to go with Mew there. Couple of dollars holographic rare, pretty good card. Can't always, can never go wrong with Mew. Let me guys, uh, let me know how you've uh, done with this set so far. Have you guys pulled anything good yet? Hopefully, better than what I'm doing right now. Oh boy. Surely there's a decent amount of ultra rares in this booster box. That wouldn't seem right, would it? <clears throat> I am a little sick lately, so if you guys hear me clear my throat, I apologize. There we go. I've got a tag team and a nice reverse hollow for Ninja to go with it. Ramosa and Buzzwool. Let me start seeing some of the good cards now. Like a Lucario and Melmetal. Back to back. That's pretty good. That's what I like to start seeing. That's what that's all. Everything was just clumped together. That's that's all. So looking pretty good so far. <clears throat> Now if we can just get a uh, hyper rare, of course, 
There's a few decent ones that we'd like to get, but we know which one we'd want. That one. If you guys aren't familiar at uh, familiar with the pricing on the Charizard, it's two hundred forty dollars right now for the card. <coughs> <coughs> It's a very good deck and standard, and it's also, of course, a Charizard card, so it's very well sought after. Oh, there we go. We got a Reshiram and a Charizard GX, so that's pretty nice. I think that's uh, doing pretty well so far. I like to see that. That's the first one I've pulled so far from this set. It's pretty nice to see it. I don't know if we can get lucky like that one girl earlier who pulled both. I can only hope my luck is as good as hers. A fire energy to go with that. And a hollow spear too. Also, another good full art card to have in this set would be the Welder card. It actually goes pretty well with the Charizard. The Restoram and Charizard. So if you guys uh, play online, I'm sure that the Reshiram and Charizard deck is pretty fun one to build on there. One of the more dominant decks. Along with, of course, the Zekrom and Pikachu tag team. I've never really played Pokemon TCG. Although I've been wanting to get into it, just kind of see what it's like. Oh, maybe I can get a couple of those Charizards and I can get going on that deck. That'd be great. Got a Kiram, <clears throat> along with a Mr. Evius. Well, I am flying through these booster packs. I thought this video would take a little longer, but I guess when you're as excited as I am about this set, it's hard to slow down. Imagine we should see a uh, hyper rare pretty soon because you might know they are pretty much guaranteed to put a booster box. And if we don't get one, it'd be very disappointing. Which I believe we got something right here. Ooh, well, that's nice. <clears throat> it may not be the Charizard, but it is the Dene, and that's a very nice hyper rare to get. That's a pretty good pull if you ask me. So, we got the Rush Ram and Charizard Tag Team GX, along with the Full Art Dedenne GX Hyper Rare. So I'd say not so bad with this box. Now, if we could pull either a Full Art or a regular GX Dedenne, that'd be cool. Or even a Full Art Trainer card as well. We still got a few packs left. It looks like about maybe around 10 or so. All right, that's actually a pretty good one to have too. A full art Guard of War and Sylveon. Uh, this is definitely a good box, I'd say. Definitely uh, making my money's worth on this box. Pretty excited about this one for sure. Seems like the booster boxes are where it's at in this set. 
I've seen a lot of people open the regular packs and they have not had much luck with them. But uh, I think I'd say my luck is pretty good with this one. I'm pretty satisfied so far. We're gonna melt metal on a litten. It would be nice to get a full art trainer card before this is all said and done. Still got about seven packs of spike. So we got a possibility that we can get one of them. Alright, we got a Celestelia GX, so at least we got a GX there. <coughs> we are down to six packs, it looks like. We get one more good pull that would make, make this probably <clears throat> close to an eight or nine out of a ten box. Oh, we get that two hypnos back to back. Only one was hollow. Then we got the. Fabio times three with the Doug Trio and a Vile Plume. And then the regular Doug Trio who's pissed because he does not have lux luxurious flowing hair like a low end Doug Trio. I don't know what the deal with a lot of these Pokemon being pissed off are. Maybe it's because they're wild and they want to be caught. Alright, down to three booster packs. Can we get something in the end here, or are we going to fizzle out? Anything else good before this is all said and done? Yeah, I got a hollow Greninja and it's landed. Alright, this is the last one. We already pulled her. Them. Let's just get one more good card out of this pack. Nope. Just a nice, happy little. Snorlax, but overall, I'd say this is a pretty good box as I spill all my cards. So, these would be the notable pulls here of course, the full art Cardivore and Sylveon, the Celestelia GX, the Dene Hyper Rare, Rush Ram and Charizard GX, Melmetal, Lucario, Feromosa Buzzwool, and a Hollow Mew. All right, everyone, thank you for watching. Have a safe weekend, happy Memorial Day, and always like, subscribe, and comment down below.